In Tanzania live 51 million people. 21.4 million are men and 24.6 million are women. We interviewed some people who work as volunteers in hospitals in rural areas of Tanzania. We asked them about the role of men and women in the family, the knowledge of HIV, the hierarchy at the hospital and religion related questions. Both men and women are hard working people. Most of the men leave their family behind at other villages and live by themselves. Most of the men who have their own family are doctors or have other important positions at the hospital. Sometimes men care for their children, but most of the time women have to take care for them. Women who work at the hospital are emancipated women who provide the income for the family. They also take care for the children and families who need help. Most important task for the women is to be a mother. There is no difference between the competence for men and women. Both gender have to work at the operation room as an assistant if needed. Only wo women work at the mother-child section. This is because there are no male midwives. Nurses have to give the medication to patients and to check the patient's health. The family have to wash and dress the patient. And if the patient is not able to eat, they also have to help him with this. So the family are more or less required to visit the patient. In the hospitals are a very clearly hierarchy. At first is the doctor. He is the most important man in the hospital. However, he is not always the most educated person because of the old study and did not follow further courses. At second is someone who takes care of the finances and the clinical officer. The last one are the nurses and midwives. The hygiene in the hospital in Tanzania compared with the hygiene in the Netherlands is poor. For example, everyone walk in and out the operation room. The operation clothes are washed, disinfected and reused instead of throwing it away. Needles are also not properly throw away. The instruments are sterilized and the medical staff wash their hands very well. In Tanzania, HIV is a taboo. Within the hospitals is an open communication with the, about the disease. The healthcare professionals know a lot about it. The local people only know that HIV is a very serious disease, but they are afraid to talk about it. The community will ignore them or look different to the infected person. At the hospitals are art clinics for people who want more information about HIV. The healthcare workers will go to the rural areas to make the people aware of HIV and give explanation how to cope with the disease. Condoms are on this, available on the street or in the art clinics. The use of the condoms is very minimal. People don't know how to use it and officially is the use of contraceptives is against of the rules of the religion. Most of the people in Tanzania are Christian or Muslim. <laughs>